Hey everyone, I'm Kyle Yates of the Fantasy Pros Football Podcast. Thanks for joining us. As always, you can find our brand new content every week at youtube.com slash fantasy pros, as well as on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and follow while you're there. Let's get right to it though, because today I'm back with our second edition of Stashes and Streamers heading into week eight. Building off of our first edition of the Stashes and Streamers segment, our goal here is to provide you with the information you need to think ahead. Being prepared allows you to gain an edge on the rest of your league, and we aim to do that by looking at five players you can stash heading into week eight, and five players you can pick up now to stream going into week nine. Let's take a look at five players you can add now to stash. Number five, Malcolm Brown, running back, Los Angeles Rams. Brown is the clear second option to Daryl Henderson in this backfield, but he would hold incredible value if something were to happen to Henderson. Brown's only 22% rostered in Yahoo leagues, which is just under our criteria, and he should be picked up if you have an extra spot on your bench. Number four, Jalen Rager, wide receiver, Philadelphia Eagles. At the time of recording, we don't have any clarity yet on when exactly Rager is going to be back in the lineup. Even if Rager sits out this next game, he's still worth picking up and stashing. It's hard to find players with Rager's opportunity and talent on the waiver wire, and he's only 15% rostered in Yahoo Leagues. Pick him up to keep him on your bench if you have the space. Number 3. Preston Williams, wide receiver, Miami Dolphins. While I don't exactly think that Williams is someone you should be rushing out to plug into your starting lineup in Week 8, he's absolutely worth stashing on your roster going into this weekend's games. With Tua Tunga Bailoa now at quarterback, we simply don't know if he's going to lock on to Devontae Parker or spread the ball around more. Williams could even become Tua's favorite target, which could mean that you stole a valuable fantasy asset right off the waiver wire. He's only 21% rostered in Yahoo Leagues and he deserves to be added due to the potential payoff. Number 2. Richard Higgins, Wide Receiver, Cleveland Browns it's not very often that you can find a starting wide receiver for an NFL team that has shown flashes when he's gotten the opportunity previously on the waiver wire in your league. Higgins is currently only 14% rostered after waivers cleared this week and it should be much, much higher than that. If you're hesitant to plug him into your starting lineup this week, he's still worth adding to your roster. If you don't want to keep him after this week where he has a good matchup against the Raiders defense, you can trade him away as part of a package deal. Number 1. Michael Pittman Jr. Wide receiver, Indianapolis Colts. Pittman's been on IR for a while, but he has returned to practice, and it looks like he may be coming off of IR here soon. With the Colts receivers struggling to do anything of note in this offense, Pittman has a chance to walk into a significant role on this team. He's a high draft pick by the Colts, and he showed signs of getting adjusted to the NFL level right before his injury. Even if you don't have the space to add him now, make sure to keep your eye on him on your league's waiver wire. Let's move over to my top five streamers for week nine. Number five, Arizona Cardinals, DST. The Cardinals aren't exactly a top five defense in the NFL, but they'll get to take on Tua Tunga Bailoa in only his second NFL game next week. While this is a bit of a guessing game right now because we haven't seen Tua play yet, rookie quarterbacks typically turn the ball over a couple of times. The Cardinals might not be a top three DST play in week nine, but they're worth plugging in if you're in a pinch. Number four, Washington football team, DST. If you're looking ahead to week 9 and your DST unit is going to be on bye, it might be a good idea to snag the Washington defense now. They have a matchup against the Giants offense and we know that this offense struggles to put points up on the board and that they turn the ball over. Snag them now before it's too late. Number 3, Kirk Cousins, quarterback, Minnesota Vikings. Cousins hasn't exactly taken care of the football so far this year, but the Vikings have had to adopt a whole new style of play that forces Cousins to throw the ball significantly more than they would like. In a matchup against the Detroit Lions defense, Cousins might easily throw for over 300 yards, and he's always good for a couple of touchdowns. You'll have to live with the interceptions, but he's a solid streaming option in Week 9. Jimmy Garoppolo, quarterback, San Francisco 49ers. Jimmy G's play has certainly been up and down this season, but when we're looking at streaming quarterbacks for Week 9, he certainly stands out. The matchup against the Packers should be a very high-scoring affair, which obviously means more opportunities for fantasy points. Garoppolo shouldn't be viewed as a top 10 lock, but if you're in desperate need of a quarterback streamer, he can be plugged in. Number 1. Logan Thomas, tight end, Washington. Thomas may have been dropped to the waiver wire in your league with his team on a bye this week. 
If you're in need of a streaming tight end for Week 9, make sure to look Thomas's way. He's involved enough in this offense to warrant consideration, and he's shown that he has the potential to find the end zone any given week. Against the Giants in Week 9, Thomas could be a perfect fill-in option for you. Thank you for tuning in to the Fantasy Pros YouTube channel. Don't forget to tell us what you think in the comments section below. And while you're there, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons so you can stay up to date on all of our future content.